as a scientist, um, we often tend to sort of follow wherever the science goes. Um, and you do one experiment, and that opens up an area you hadn't predicted, and you, and you go somewhere else. Then there's some scientists like myself that have a particular goal in mind. Um, and in my case, the goal is to, to provide uh, new treatments and therapies for people with diabetes, in particular trying to come up with new ways to make or to, or to replace um, beta cell function in people with diabetes. When we started, it was, it was uh, the, the, the idea that we could make beta cells um, uh, either in a dish or in a patient was, was really pie in the sky. Um, that was uh, the kind of thing that uh, you didn't put in a grant application because you knew the reviewers would laugh at you. 25, 30 years later, um, in fact, people put in their grant applications all the time. And the reason is because, in fact, people are now generating um, insulin producing cells uh, in the uh, uh, culture dish. Um, and those cells are looking more and more like, like really normal beta cells. We really are, I think, on the cusp uh, of putting those cells into patients and actually demonstrating that we can replace beta cells uh, in people with diabetes.